The analog control system that gave you total control over your punches in Fight Night 2004 now gives you total control over your entire boxer's body using the two analog sticks. In Fight Night 2004, limitations in our controls prevented you from being able to do things like punch and move at the same time, so anytime you wanted to punch, you had to plant your feet on the canvas. This year's new control system allows you to do everything simultaneously. So you can punch and move all at the same time, enabling boxing strategies like stick and move, or just being able to quickly move to the side and get angles to throw punches at on your opponent. Same thing was true for blocking. Anytime you wanted to block a punch, you had to plant your feet on the canvas, which really doesn't make much sense because if you're trying to avoid a punch, you want to be moving. So Fight Night 2005 with our new analog controls, you're able to do it all simultaneously. So you can punch and move, trying to move out of the way of the punches, and then using the blocking to just pick off last straight punches. Last year, we couldn't even move our upper body and move our fists at the same time, doing like the Muhammad Ali rope -a Again, Fight Night Round 2, all of this is now possible through our total boxer control, our updated analog control system. Another problem we had with our analog controls was our combo system. The analog combos were extraordinarily slow. In fact, button press combos ended up being faster than the analog combos that we shipped in Fight Night 2004. So for EA Sports Fight Night Round 2, we now have a quick combo system using the analog stick. You just quickly move the analog stick back and forth, and you now can throw even faster combos than you can with the button presses.